Oh, thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Praise God. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Shalom. The Lord bless you. I welcome you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise God. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Oh, Holy Spirit, thank you. Please, if you're seeing me for your very first time, my name is Ethel Betamba, and this is Prayer and the Prophetic with Pastor Ethel. You are very much welcome in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise God. You've been family, of course, you know that I love you so much. And my prayer for you is that the good Lord rewards your consistency, blesses you as never before, does something good and amazing in your life. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. So the title of this particular prophetic word says, this will be the biggest change ever. I say it again. The title of this particular prophetic word says, this will be the biggest change ever. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise God. I am super excited about this particular prophetic word because of what God is about to do in the life of somebody. And that particular person is you. You have been praying and you have been trusting God for a long time. You have been waiting on God for a long time. The Bible says in the book of Psalms 126, the Bible says, For when the Lord turned again the captivity of Zion, the Bible says, They were like them that train. Then their mouths were filled with laughter in their tongues with singing. Then said thee, the hidden, the Lord has done great things for them. The hidden were their neighbors. The hidden were people who were watching them, their lives. Every human being, everybody has somebody who is watching them. Like has somebody who is checking to see if change is going to happen in their lives has somebody who is maybe monitoring to see if there is going to be growth and on the other hand you will have people around you and these particular people around you have known you for a while the some of them grew up with you some of them are your neighbors some of them are your family members some of them are your friends like these are people who practically see you worship God. They see you doing fasting. They see you doing prayers. Like they see you doing a lot, you know. And they have been waiting to see what God is going to do in your life. They have been waiting to see what you're going to become. They have been waiting to see the kind of blessings you're going to possess or achieve. You know, so on the other hand, you have you. You have been trusting and believing God. You have been praying that the Lord is going to bless you. You have been praying that God is going to do something great and amazing in your life. So you have three categories of people who are involved. In this particular case or scenario, I spoke about the people around you who have been watching you, who are not close to you, like close to you, like there are people who observe you from a distance, but they know what is happening in your life. Like they know everything that is happening in your life. There are people who observe you from a close range, your own family, your own uh close friends, 
you know, the other people, your neighbors, people who hear about you. And then the last category, which is number three, is you. Looking at yourself and saying, I want the blessing. I want a change. Somebody, you've accumulated prayer points. You have accumulated prayer requests. And this has been for a while now. Accumulated prayer points. Accumulated prayer requests. It's been going on for a while now. Now, this is what God is about to do in your life. God is about to grant your heart desires one after the other. All. I say it again. God is about to grant your heart desires one after the other. But all. I'm, when I'm talking about all, I'm talking about the accumulated prayer points you've accumulated. Praying for this, praying for that, praying for the other, praying for the other, praying for the other. So it's been a lot of these prayer points. You've accumulated them. God wants to grant your heart desire. He wants to give you all at once. He will bless you in such a way that you will be so shocked and you will be so surprised. You're, you're going to get to that particular stage where you will learn to trust God. In his right time. You will learn to trust God. And say God I trust you're going to do it. When you have to do it. Or when you want to do it. That is the stage God wants you to be. That is the level he wants you to get to. I speak into the life of somebody. God says this will be the biggest change in your life. What will be the biggest change? He will answer your prayer points. Your prayer requests one after the other but he will answer all and this will be a big change a big change because you're going to have an all-around blessing you will be so shocked all you need to do right now is to believe it and is to connect yourself in the mighty name of jesus amen i speak into your life let this prophetic word manifest let it happen in Jesus' mighty name, amen. It will manifest all one by one in the name of Jesus, amen. Somebody type it on the comment section. Connect yourself, make that confession. Say, every of my prayer requests is about to manifest. Say it again. Every of my prayer requests is about to manifest. For the last time, every of my prayer requests is about to manifest in the name of Jesus, amen. God bless you. Please do not forget to pray for me as the Spirit of the Lord who laid you. Do not forget, please, to like, share, and subscribe. You just subscribe. You're welcome to the family now. May the Lord bless you, keep you, cast his face to shine on you. May he be gracious to you and may he give you peace. The shalom of the Lord, nothing missing, nothing broken. I love you, I do. I love you. God bless you amazingly and abundantly. Shalom.